Hey guys, it is Kayla Waller with Waller Adventures and we are on the way to Atlantic Beach, North Carolina. Now, earlier this week we dropped a video on those SC um, V2 fishing pole holders for Toyota Tacomas. And so I have mine in the back of my truck and we're going to put it to the test on this nine and a half hour drive to Atlantic Beach, North Carolina. So I'll show you what they look like. We are in Daytona Beach, which is like an hour-ish away from Orlando. And so far, everything is holding up pretty good. Um, like I said in the video, I was going to try the chains. And I kind of ran it through where the bungee piece is. And it's going through here. So that way, if you take it out, you're not going to be able to pull it. But um, so far, the chain's doing pretty good. I got the, the luggage locks on it that um, I use for camping. But yeah, so far it's holding up pretty good. Um, driving like 70 miles an hour on um, I-4, um, they kept them in there pretty sturdy. The only thing that is really moving is the tips. They're doing this number, but they're not like flapping in the wind, blowing everywhere. So I just got some gas at the Bucky's. I'm gonna stop and get some breakfast. And then the next time we will check in on our uh, fishing pole holders will probably be South Carolina, maybe. So we will see you then. All right, so we are in Santee General Store. We're in Santee, South Carolina. And as you can see, they're still holding up pretty good. Still holding up pretty tight. Yep. Yep. I think that's good. All right, so we made it to Atlantic Beach, North Carolina. And as you can see, they held up. Look at me, it held up really good. Highly recommend them for your Toyota Tacoma to carry your fishing poles.